Hello everyone, Matthew Hawkins back again with another video and this is that time of year when All Elite Wrestling and New Japan Pro Wrestling open the Forbidden Door. Yes, it's time for Forbidden Door 2, Canadian Boogaloo shall we say as it's happening tonight at the Scotiabank Centre in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. The second leg I should say of AEW's Canadian Summer Tour. That seems to be going on as they're going to Calgary and Saskatchewan and Hamilton and all these other places in Canada. And the first big event of the top is this Forbidden Door. For the second year in a row, we have this pay per view with all the wrestling and New Japan Pro Wrestling coming together. I mean, a lot of positive things about the crowd so far. Let's go on with these predictions, shall we? I don't want to waste any more time. I don't know what to say anymore. Just here's my predictions for the show. End up, let's go on with them, shall we? Right, we start with Zero Hour, the buy-in, the pre-show, whatever you want to call it. It's fine, as long as it's, as long as it's ethical and reasonable, it's accepted here. And we start off as the Owen Hart Cup, which obviously that'll be a big part of this Canadian tour. The first round match in the Women's Owen Hart Memorial Tournament as the Fallen Goddess Athena challenge faces the 18 year old sensation Billy Starks. I'm as much as I to go with Billy Starks because it'd be a string in there, but I feel safer going with Athena. And because of that, I'm going to go with Athena on this one. Right, moving on to the second of four pre show matches, I should say, as the United Empire's Jeff Cobb, Cal Fletcher, and TJ P will face Lawson Gubernabo at their pond. Shingo Takaji, Bushi, and Hiromu Takahashi. And well, I am going to go with Los Ingobernables. There! Ha! Pawn! Yes, yeah, so I'll go with the team of Takaji, Bushi, and Takahashi on this one. It's a toss up. I'll go with them. Right, moving on to match number three as Stu Grayson will fit with the righteous Vincent and Dutch in his corner face, El Phantasma, Stu Grayson. Again, another toss up. I'm going to go with Stu Grayson on this one. Right, which match next? The last match of the pre show as the Mogul Embassy, which is the team of Swerve Strickland, Toa, Leona, Brian Cage, and Bishop Thorne with Prince Nana in their corner. Well, first is the Chaos Faction. You've got Rocky Romero, Chuck Taylor and Trent Barrett, and El Desperado. And, well, I shall go with Chaos. I'm going to go with Chaos on this one. Right, those are the pre-show matches. It's time now for the main card. And which match to start? How about the first round match in the men's own hard cup as CM Punk, yes, he returned to AEW this past I believe last week on Collision, he came back. He's facing Satoshi Kojima in the first round of the Owen Hart Cup. And I'm going to go with CM Punk. I just feel it'd be better going with CM Punk. And because of that, I'm going to go with him on this one. Right, what match next? How about the IWGP World Heavyweight title match? That was on the line as Sonata will defend against Jungle Boy Jack Parry with Hooking in his corner. And plain and simple, I'm going to go with Sonata because I, I don't see Jack Perry doing the New Japan side of the schedule defending the belt. So I'm going to go with Sonata to retain his title on this one. Next match, how about the six man tag match between the Suzuki Gods as Chris Jericho and Sammy Guevara with teams up with the legendary Minoru Suzuki and they face Sting, Darby Allen, and Tetsuya Naito. Suzuki's a beast. But I want to go with Sting, Darby Allen, and Texas United. So that looks like a dream match, and that is going to look very good. I hope that match is very, very good. I'm, look, I'm kind of looking forward to just reading that. I want to watch that match. Right, what match next? How about the four way match for the AW International Championship? As Orange Cat, Fresh and Squeezed, Orange Cassidy defends his belt against Zack Sabre Jr., Katsuyori Shibata, and Daniel Garcia. Cassidy to his head. Plain and simple, I'm going to go with Cassidy to retain. Coming through these picks thick and fast. Um, what match next? How about the singles match for the AW Women's World Title? Let's do some defense against Will and Nightingale. And I'm going to go with Tony Storm. Just going to go with Tony Storm on this one. Next, please. Tony Storm. 
so right there. I think the only leaves a handful of matches left on the card. How about the 10 man tag team matches, the Blackpool Combat Clubs, John Moxley, Will You, and Claudio Castagnoli, and Kanosia Takeshita, and even Shota Umino is facing off against the Elite. That's Hamman Adam Page, the Young Bucks, with also Eddie Kingston and the Stone Pitbull himself, Tomohiro Ishii. And I would like to go with the Elite. They might have an ego, but they might not. But I'm going to go with the BCC. I feel. The BCC will look stronger coming out of this one, so I'm going to go with the BCC on this one. The Blackpool Comic Club, Takeshita, and Shota Umino. Right, which match next? How about for the AW World Championship as Maxwell Jacob Freeman, who is better than you and you know it, faces the ace of the universe, Hiroshi Tanahashi, the AW World Championship. I don't see Tanahashi doing the AW schedule. Otherwise, if they really want to hot potato the belt, so I'm going to go with MJF on this one. I think Twins and one, I'm going to go with MJF. Right, now is the time for the big two matches as how about for the IWGP US Heavyweight Championship, Kenny Omega faces the Kingpin. Will Ospreay, this match is going to be an absolute classic, I can guarantee that. This one really hard to take. Uh, I'm just going to go with Kenny. I'm going with Kenny to win this one, I think, but this match will be an absolute classic, I guarantee you that. As will the match, I think, the main event, the first match announced as Brian Danielson, the American Dragon, will face off against the Rainmaker, Kazuchika Okada. This is going to be an absolute classic. I guarantee you that. I'm going to say that again. It is going to be a classic. I don't know who to tip on this one, but I'm going to go with the Rainmaker. Might be wrong. But I'm hoping this match will be a classic. I'm going with the Rainmaker. End of. I'm going with the Rainmaker. End of. End of discussion. Akara. Thanks, right, 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 right. Those are my predictions for AW and New Japan's Forbidden Door 2. What do you think of my predictions? And let me know yours down in that comment section below. As always. If you have enjoyed this video, be sure to click it a thumbs up. If you are brand new to this channel and you like what you see here, you want some more, be sure to click that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you know whenever the hell I post next. Be sure to tell your friends how much of a great YouTuber I am and to follow me on Twitter at Hawkins and Scott Matt US and on Instagram at Big Matt Hawk 18. But as always though, remember, you need some cheer, have no fear, Big Matt Hawk is here!